I think it was clear from the beginning that when you read through the nominations that this was an exceptional candidate. What's really interesting about what Maeve did with the Magdalena Laundries is an example of what we're trying to do in the school in terms of showing the students that you can transform society through the contributions you make in the legal sphere. The state was involved in commercially supporting the Magdalene Laundries. The women in the laundries were washing army laundry, prison laundry, industrial school laundry. She graduated in 2009, graduated with first and went on to Harvard. But it's what you like to think the students will do. You know, those that are interested in sort of the experience or the transforming power of law will go on and sort of do things that sort of demonstrate how law can be used for social purposes. Ireland held an obligation when it knew that forced labour conditions amounting to servitude were ongoing, it had an obligation to intervene to prevent those. Rather than taking cases to court, she collected evidence and brought it to the UN. I think it yielded great benefits because she was able to talk to lots of people who had been affected got their evidence, and that evidence is very compelling. If you look at her current work, she's taking on a large multinational company uh, in defending 15,000 Nigerian fishermen in their claim against Shell Oil. <laughs> she also plays the piano apparently really, really well.